Okay guys, so once you open the uh, the cover, uh, you're gonna be left with this. So there's a lot of insides. You'll see this big silver thing right here. Uh, this is where you're gonna need to uh, do a little bit of work to replace the SD card. So if I see that, if I can zoom in here, hopefully it's not too shiny. You can see here that it's just this, the silver cover. So onto this is the mini SD card. So I'm gonna show you how to easily remove this. Okay, so what you wanna do is first get this corner right here. And if you have something pointy enough, you should be able to just kinda of get it right under that corner and just pop it up. Just pop it up. Um, you'll notice that it causes a little bit of a bend in the middle. That's okay. Uh, don't pull it up all the way. Just wanna pop it up and it should just kinda of gently lift up that side. Then on the other side, uh, on that corner as well, right here, get a little pointy thing under that edge and pop it up and you saw it there, uh, it should just come right up and off. So after you get those two edges, you should be able to just pull this right off. Uh, you will notice that it's got a little bit of a bend in it now. So just push that back. And then once that's off, take a look at this and you can see, um, mine actually has an SD card. I'm just giving this as an example. Um, most of you that are doing this will not have an SD card. And so from here, uh, there's a couple things to do. Uh, you'll see right here that there's some glue. And so we gotta pick this glue off here and here. Uh, we can see that this is the top of the SD card right here. And so it's actually going to hinge up this way. Let me demonstrate, it'll hinge up like this where we can insert or remove the SD card. Um, and so what I would do now, would be to go ahead and basically just get this glue off of here. Okay, so after you get off all that glue, you're gonna be left with something that looks kind of like this. Um, I'll see if I can get in here in the video. Uh, you'll see there that there's a little metal thing. And there's a hinge here, there's a hinge here. So be very careful when you're taking the glue off. So I freed those. And then this basically comes up like this. Most of you guys won't have the SD card in it yet, so it's going to really just look like this. Again, the hinges are in the middle, so you're going to pop this up. Here's the, uh, here's the SD card. So essentially, this just goes in this little slot. and then push it down. Put that back on. That should hold it in, um, but I don't trust it. So I recommend just doing a, a dab of glue. Again, that's real easy to pop off. <clears throat> so I'm actually gonna do another dab of glue to, to hold it back down. Um, I don't have the exact same kind, but for most of you guys, again, you're going from nothing to putting an SD card in. So you put your SD card in, you want to hold this down, and then not necessarily a dab of glue here, but you can re-glue the hinge so that the hinge locks down. Now the, the key is to make sure that you have good connection on the contacts in there. Um, otherwise the SD card won't be red. Um, again, the metal plate should hold it down good enough. Um, so if you don't have any glue, the, the metal plate should work. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and um, re-glue it uh, just a little bit is to, to lock things down there. Um, and then I'll go ahead and put it back together. So that's uh, that's how you do that. Um, so yeah, I basically put a little dab of glue here and here, uh, put this back on, put the shell back on, and you're good to go.